Good afternoon and welcome to Woodbridge, the best town around. My name is John McCormick, I'm the mayor of this great town. And we are here today after the most anticipated grand opening probably in the history of Woodbridge Township. Uh, 14 months from last May 5th when uh, Dave closed up Treasure Garden uh, 2015. And here we are on July 6th of, is it 6th or 7th? 6th. 6th. July 6th of 2016 for the grand reopening of 3-in-1 restaurant here on Inman Avenue in Colonia, a couple doors down from the post office right next to the VFW. This has been a great place for many years, and it just got three times better with the 3-in-1 restaurant. It's a Chinese restaurant. It's got a phenomenal... Man. I'll, I'll get to you, man. Come on, man. I'll give you a chance. So Dave, uh, Dave has um, had a rough time of it. It was you know, very much a challenge to get this place opened and done but it's absolutely beautiful. I'd now like to introduce Dave and ask Dave to say a few words about, you know, all that you went through, if you want, and all that you, what you have here, the three different, three different restaurants. Uh, tell us everything you can. Yay, Dave. Let's hear it for Dave. You know what? First of all, I want to thank my uh, beautiful wife, and um, a lot of friends and family who's got my back through all this. The town's been great. Rumors that got it that was township giving you problems, this and that, and you know what? They've been great. It's really uh, what took so long was we have a lot of crooked contractors out there. Um, and um, this project should have been finished a long time ago. Uh, just want to say we're back, we're bigger, and we hope to be better than ever before. Three and one stands for really lock, bar, and grill. But more importantly, it stands for these three right here. Honestly, if it was just me and her, what I had here was fine. So, but you know, you can't stay still. So, I hope everybody who has supported us in the past, and more will support us in the future. I want to thank Mayor McCormick and uh, all the fine guests here for being here. Like I said, all my friends, family. Yep. I uh, had chef for 16 years, and my new chef, Nalki, you know, hopefully for another 16 years. <laughs> That's an applause line, come on, give him a break. Give him a break. It's been, it's been tough, you know, I just ask everybody for their patience, it's, it's a learning experience. Uh, you know, that's it, drink up. Yay! Good luck, Dave! No, no, we're not done yet. We're not done yet. Introduce these, uh, introduce the three. What are the names of the three guys in front of, three people in front of me here? Ethan, Corey, and Audrey. Okay, and this is Cindy. Dave's wife is Cindy. This is not just the best Chinese restaurant in Colonia. It's not just the best Chinese restaurant in Woodbridge. Treasure Garden was the best Chinese restaurant ever. And I really mean that. I really mean that. And you all would agree with me. I mean, I was a semi-regular here. I came here all the time. You know, Dave and I would bet the Yankees versus the Red Sox. Usually I would win for many years. Last couple of years he got me. But uh, this is just a wonderful place. It's a family-owned restaurant. And so many places now are chains, and there's nothing wrong with chains. But there's also nothing like a good, solid family restaurant where you know the people behind the bar, you know the people waiting on you, you know they're going to be the ones that make the money from your patronage, not some chain who knows where and what state, wherever. This is a family-owned restaurant. They've done a phenomenal job. They made a major investment in this, more than they wanted. Uh, but I'm telling you, I was here for two of the soft openings. It is phenomenal. He had a mahi-mahi grilled uh, piece of fish the other day that I, I tell you, no better, no, nowhere better. And the time before, I think it was, um, uh, what do you call it, chicken, um, sesame chicken was just completely terrific. So best of luck. I'm going to introduce some of the people with us. Debbie Meehan, our councilwoman from Colonia, who lives just up the street. And She's who's, awesome. Who's She's had many, a new crosswalk. Uh, many a dinners with me here. Uh, Carolyn Ehrlich. Chief of Staff, who lives right around the corner, who's had many dinners with me here, 
uh, Martalevsky, our planning director, who also lives in Colonia like the three of us do, and Nancy Drum from uh, the First Ward. She's our council president. So we're all out here to welcome Dave and wish him the best of luck. So Dave, congratulations. I know it's a, it's a very emotional moment for you because of all you went through. But trust me, whatever you spent, you're going to make it many times over. This place is absolutely beautiful. Explain the restaurant itself now. You got three different rooms. Explain them. I got three different rooms. Um, the main room is is what I call the main bar. You know, it's got 20 televisions in there, widescreen televisions in there. I've had uh, football uh, Sundays here for about 10 years, and in a much smaller bar, I had 13 televisions in there, and we have a lot of regulars. You know, it's, this is home to not just me to all the people that have been coming in here supporting us, and I hope it becomes home to our staff, our new hires, you know. Uh, second room would be the dining room, you know, and uh, that one has a actually like a raw bar in there, which, you know, we'll get up and running. And the third one has a patio bar. It has a little uh, patio. You can have a little uh, outdoor dining area. And this weather is too hot, but so uh, the same menu yep. covers all the same restaurants. Same menu covers all three. So even different if you're sections, in the regular, right. room, you can still yes. get the raw bar. Right. No absolutely. matter where you are, you get the menu. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. So it's just a good place to come, chat. You know, have a, have a good time with your friends. Yeah. All right. Let's ask Councilwoman Debbie uh, Meehan from Colonia if she would come up and say a few words. Thank God you're done, because you. I was telling the council I got more calls about. You, you guys being open and potholes or anything else yeah, in this town. Yeah. The people most important thing in Colonia yeah, is here. They complain so. more about this place not being open than they did about property taxes. I'm yeah. telling you, it's the truth. So it's the truth. We welcome you back. We've missed you. This is our, this my counter um, councilwoman told me I'm, she'll never see me again because I'm Unless I here all the time. And you're a Red Sox fan, so guess what? Oh, that's <laughs> a problem. I'm not a Red Sox fan. I'm an anti Yankee fan. So oh, see? <laughs> Now it all comes out. It all comes out. But it is absolutely beautiful. When you walk through the door, this is home to everybody in this town. And we're hoping many people from the township come here. The food is great. Your new staff is fabulous. And it's just, I'm so glad you're back. And I know you went through a lot. So Congratulations. How many, um, how many people do you employ? Oh, you know what? Before it was me, myself, and I, my wife, and, and, two, uh, and two, two other waitresses. girls. Yes. Yeah. And a couple of added on about almost. 15 to 20, you know, between part-time and full-time, yeah. And what, should, what are your hours? Weekdays from 3 to 10, uh, Friday All to Saturday. Weekdays? Even Except Monday? Except Tuesday and close. Oh, I'm Tuesday open and close, okay. Yeah, close Tuesdays, and then uh, Friday and sa uh, Saturdays and Sundays will be from 12 to 10 and 11. Okay, yeah. now tell me about the yeah. menu. We only saw pieces of it. You had like a, a limited menu the first night, limited menu the second right. night. Mm -hmm. What's the menu like? Well, you know what, let uh, my chef... Oh, okay, to... come on in. Yeah. Uh, Get closer. Like all American dishes, British dishes, Get a little uh, to the mic, yeah. steaks, a uh, couple of pastas, some appetizers such as calamari, um, sweet and Irish dip, which you have the first time you come in, and the fish that you have was actually black and mine. Oh my god, was that good! Oh, it was so with, good. Uh, sweet potato and crab meat, uh, hash brown. I didn't have the sweet, sweet potato, I just had the crab meat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and we're just gonna keep on going from there, you know, adding on. Yeah, and our, our Chinese menu pretty much stayed the same, you know, so you'll get all your favorites. So you, you can only do so much chicken lo mein, chicken chow mein with football or baseball, you know, so we'll have some you know, burgers, you know, ribs, wings, stuff like that, yeah. Well, I'm going to exaggerate when I say this is the best Chinese food around. It yeah, he's going to do corned beef and cabbage on Irish on St. Patrick's Day next year, so make sure you're here. There's a line. You know, oh, I saw that face. I don't know. No, no. there's so many lines there, I just don't know which one yeah. to use. <laughs> Carol, do you want to say anything? Have you yeah. I'm just thrilled, David, that you're back and open, and Cindy and the kids. You know, I, I'm standing there thinking, what are the landmarks that we have in Colonia? And you're it. It's three in one now. You are the landmark. You're home to so many people. And thank you, because there's nothing like having a bar you can walk to. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Nancy, you want to say something to this council president? Sure. Even though you're from Woodbridge. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I was hungry on my drive over here and now listening to the chef. I'm starving, so I can't wait to have a bite to eat. But congratulations on behalf of the Chamber of Commerce. I heard a lot of stories, and I'm so happy that you're open as well, and I wish you the best of success.
us. Thank you. And Thank I told you. Debbie, it's true, I'm um, going to have to come here and find her because I know she's going to be here. We already have a meeting scheduled here. Me too. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. sure. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank now, you. when Dave said the uh, town was accommodating, that's not the mayor's office, that's the planning office and the building department. That's more than Why do you want to say anything? Just that uh, we're thrilled that you're finally back. We've worked so much with you for so long to get you there. Uh, it's just awesome that you're, gonna, that you're back. Thank you. Thank you. We look forward to seeing you. All right, now it's time to cut the ribbon first for the guys with pictures. Let me slide over here and take a picture with Dave and his family. Let me sneak in. All right, okay. hold on. Sneak in here for everybody who wants to take a picture. Okay. All right, we're going to count down from five. Boy, grab it. Four. Come on, cut it. Three. Two. One. Welcome back to Woodridge. Yeah.